A passenger plane has crashed in the capital of Mexico's Durango state just moments after takeoff. AL-103 passengers and crew on board the Aeromexico flight survived the crash, but 97 of them are injured. State Governor Jose Rosas Espiro said the plane was hit by a gust of wind, which caused a sudden descent. ITS left wing then touched the ground and two engines came off. Most of the passengers were able to walk away before it caught fire. Aeromexico flight AM2431 was flying from Guadalupe Victoria International Airport in Durango to Mexico City when it crashed at around 1600 hours local time, 2100 hours GMT. Initial reports spoke of 97 passengers and four crew. But Governor Roses said that two children were also on board bringing the total to 103. The plane's pilot is one of two who were seriously injured. He needed an operation on his spine, but is reportedly in a stable condition. A young girl sustained burns. 97 other people were taken to hospital, but most had only very light injuries, officials said. Passenger Jacqueline Flores described the moment she knew something was wrong. When we were already aloft, up high, it felt like the plane was going to level out, but just then it plunged to the ground, she told the AFP news agency. I think we fell back on the runway because it was a hard surface, then we skidded on the ground until it stopped," the 47-year-old said. I undid my seatbelt and saw flames and realized we had to jump. There was a hole right next to us where the plane had broken up. I told my girl. We have to jump over here, and we jumped," she added. A local politician on board the flight, Romulo Campuzano, said he had been very lucky because I was able to get out by the main door. He said the door had been torn off and was lying next to the plane acting as a ramp. I walked away from the plane, turning around to see if the other passengers were getting out too. It started raining very hard, and I think that helped put out the flames," he said. Governor Roses said the crew were able to deploy the evacuation slides shortly after the crash, allowing those still on board to leave the plane safely before the flames spread. The airline Aeromexico has a good safety record, according to local media. ITS last deadly accident was in 1981, when 32 people were killed when an Aeromexico plane crashed on landing in northern Chihuahua State. The airport operator, Grupo Aeroportuario Centro Norte, said early data suggested bad weather was the cause and that the plane had taken off during a heavy hailstorm before being forced to attempt an emergency landing. One passenger said the plane had been hit by lightning. In a statement, Aeromexico said they deeply regret the accident, while Brazilian plane company Embraer said they had sent a team to the crash site.